Good morning, everyone. All right, so I have to apologize. Sorry, I was a little absent yesterday. Um, so if you logged in, you checked in, great job. I'm not gonna go back through and, and play catch up, um, but I just want you to say, I just wanna say good job yesterday. So as we go into the weekend, I want you guys to all be thinking of one thing. Um, Insanity Max Group, you're wrapping up month one, which I can't even believe. Um, everyone else, I think you're going into week two or three, I can't remember. Um, but here's the thing that I want you guys to think about. Um, and I, Casey Arns showed the, shared this video in our um, team coaching page, and it was absolutely great, and I absolutely loved it, and that's why I wanted to share it with you guys. And it's a concept called resting on your laurels. And what it means is in the Greece Olympics, when someone won the Olympics, they would place a wreath on their head, and it was considered resting on your laurels. And what that meant is that once you had a significant win, you then took a break and you rested on that success. And the point that Casey made is when you think about this in your health and fitness journey, it really can match. So let's say you've had a significant win. Let's say you've lost five pounds this month. Let's say you lost 10 inches or you're having really good success. And so you think you get on the scale and you're like, dang, I did really good. All right, well, you know what, this weekend I'm just going to kind of relax um, and just kind of eat what I want and just might skip my workouts. Cause I'm like, dang, I'm down five pounds. Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling good. My jeans are fitting better. All right, so let's say you rest on your laurels over the weekend and you kind of just splurge. Um, well, come Monday, you hop back on the scale and let's say you didn't really gain any weight. Your pants are still fitting pretty good. You're like, yeah, all right, okay. So you kind of continue to rest on those laurels because you didn't see any change. Um, and you think, yeah, okay, maybe I can skip, you know, have a little bit of cheat here, a little bit of cheat here. Before you know it, the resting on those laurels become where you were before. You're back to where you were because you took advantage of that resting on your laurels. So is it okay to rest from time to time? Absolutely. Did I rest yesterday? 100%. But the point being is don't keep resting. If you want a day to rest, that's fine. But don't lose your gains because you're too busy resting. So I hope that makes sense. Casey explained it really good. Um, but you know, just if, you, if your goal is 30 pounds to lose and you've lost five, don't let the resting on your laurels celebrating that five pounds of success. And should you celebrate 100%? Yes. But don't rest too long that you don't get back on track and you lose sight of your goals that you originally intended. So have a great Friday, guys. Um, we are headed down to Nebraska City with our family. I just found out tomorrow we're going to the game. So it, it's becoming a crazy weekend, a lot more filled than I thought. But I'm getting ready to push play, and I am taking my shake today. I'm packing it this morning on our way down to Nebraska City because I am not missing that. I missed it yesterday, and I can just tell. So anyway, have a fantastic day, guys. Um, keep rocking it. It's Friday. Let's hear your success. Um, comment below. I want to hear some, some, some successes for the week. So great job, everyone, and we'll talk to you all soon. Bye.